The Loop dashboard is the landing page you see when you log in, and we've made several key improvements to it. You can change how your courses are displayed. You have three choices. Display your courses as pictures, as illustrated here. Display them as a list, or indeed display them by summary. We've also added a recently accessed block. This will display the, the three most recent courses you've accessed. Furthermore, we have a recently accessed item, and this will display the last item that you were in within one of your courses. We've brought back the ability to favorite a course. And now it's possible to filter the modules just so you can see your favorites. Equally, you can hide modules. For example, modules may appear on your dashboard because you are the coordinator, but don't actually teach on that module. Now you can hide it to help declutter your dashboard. The timeline block, which allows students to see all of their deadlines from across all of their programs, has been given a more modern feel. Furthermore, students can now see their deadlines by the next seven days, 30 days, three, three months, and indeed six months. Returning to the dashboard, you will see that we've also added four shortcuts for each module on your dashboard to make life a little easier for you. For example, if you see the course here, Biology 101, each of the four icons bring you into specific features on this course. For example, one icon brings you to the course page with editing turned on, a second icon to get a list of participants on the course pages, the third one to the discussion forms, and once you're in the course, you can enter these pages in the usual way, these shortcuts through the icons are just for your convenience. Finally, there's a search bar up the top of your course page. And in previous years, you could only search for course titles, whereas now you can search for items within your courses. For example, if I search for marketing, it will come up with all of the content where marketing is mentioned. And it will tell you not only the actual content, but what course it's in. These are just a selection of the improvements that are due out for the academic year. And news on further developments will be shared in coming weeks.